In the criminal justice system, sexually based offenses are considered especially heinous. In New York City, the dedicated detectives who investigate these vicious felonies are members of an elite squad known as the Special Victims Unit. These are their stories. Well, Costello, I'm going to be working this case with you. Bucky Harris, the department chief, gave me the job of lead investigator. Now, Abbott, as you know, this is a brutal case, striking the most vulnerable members of our society. Sex workers. And worse, women. Uh, they're like babies you can have sex with. In this case, for money. But men like this gotta go muck it up for the rest of us. Now, without further ado, please tell me the names of these women. Well, you know, I'll tell you their names, but strange as it seems to me, these sex workers nowadays have very peculiar names. Well, funny names? Strange names, like uh, Crystal Meth, or her sister, Angel Dust. Oh, Mary Joanna. Yeah, Mary Joanna. <laughs> Let's see, we've got, uh, who's full of semen? What's in a well with a basket of lotion? And I don't knows in thirds, no face. That's what I want to find out. Who's full of semen? What's in a well? I don't knows in thirds. Are you the lead investigator? Yes. You're gonna be the point man too? Yes. And you don't know these birds' names? Well, I should. Well, then who's full of semen? Yes. I mean the birds' name. Who? The guy full of semen. Who? The danger and jism. Who? The body jam with baby batter. Who? I'm asking you who's full of semen. That's the gal's name. That's who? That's right. What's the name of the broad popping with people porridge? No, what's in the well? I'm not asking who's in the well. Who's full of semen? I don't know. She's in thirds, no face. We're not talking about her. How do we get to no face? Why, you mentioned her name. If I mentioned the girl in thirds, who'd I say is no face? No, who's full of semen? What's full of semen? No, what's in the well? I don't know. She's in thirds, no, no face. Oh my God, no face. <laughs> Would you just uh, stay on no face and don't go off of her? Well, what do you want to know? Now, who's got no face? Why do you insist on splitting who in thirds? Split in thirds? Well, how else would she fit in the refrigerator? What? No, no, no. What's not in the fridge? What's in the well? One dead dame at a time, damn it! You don't know who's in the well? No! Who's full of semen? I don't know! No face! <laughs> Look, you got a suspect? Sure. And that suspect is? I have no clue. You just said you had a suspect. I do. So why don't you tell me? I did. And the prime suspect's name? I have no clue. You have no clue? No, that's his brother. That's whose brother? Of course not. He works in Congress. All right! Well, if you found all this semen, how come none of it's in evidence? I checked early. I have no clues full of semen. Well, I'm sure that he was, but he isn't anymore. Who is? Who? Yes. Who's semen? I have no clues. Who's semen? I already told you I have no clues. Who's semen? Well, I guess possession is nine tenths of the law, but that's a pretty sick sense of humor you got there. Are you on crack or something? Who's on crack? Jesus Christ, man, show some respect. You don't know what these women had to go through so that we could be heroes. You try to confront the horror, then judge. Oh, God. Oh, God, this job is killing me. What kind of world do we live in? What kind of God would let his children go in such a sick, fucking, twisted type of way? Ah, screaming, crying alone in the bottom of the well. It's just, it's just, I don't know. No face! Oh, so who is the girl full of semen? Yeah, her name is who? Oh, yeah, and what's another name, and I don't know, it's all names? Yes, they're all, they're <laughs> all names. Yeah, peculiar names, very funny, very funny names. <laughs>